Okay. It's not like crazy early in the morning, but it's early enough. Shooting on the 28-70 kit lens. Shooting in manual. Instantly quite excited about this morning because the light, normally I shoot in the evening, so the, the sun's over this side, but because the sun's over that side, this should be a lot, should feel a lot different instantly. Walks into the middle. Not a bad start. These are quite cool as well. Nice frame of the door there, just got to wait for someone to come past and maybe fill that frame a little bit. It's a cool frame, but... Super crazy bright morning. Let's slim this in shutter speed. Slim this in shutter priority. Get it nice and dark. That'll be a nice cool silhouette. Hopefully the, the actual clock face will glow a little bit more. Do you want a male model in that photo? Oh, I'd love one. Oh, I don't now. I'll try in the middle. Selfish delivery oh, drawer. I know. Like, you the the <laughs> <laughs> Terrible, Why doesn't the green king go and park there? That okay. I would be all right with. <laughs> oh, I was going to line up a frame there, but. In that frame, it's kind of where a load of delivery drivers will park up. Which, fair enough, you know, you park where you want as long as it's as long as you're allowed to. But it just ruins that frame quite often. Let's see if we can get some of this through the through the trees. Maybe frame it with the trees a little bit. Slow it down. Yeah, it's a nice even frame, which is cool, but that's about all that's got going for it. The nice 
nice. This nice hair. Hair's really nice. Be cool to have a person like walking past. This is nice here, I think. Dude on a scooter looks nice. Let's get this to one thirty of a second. See if we can't. Don't know. I was in single shot there, so I probably missed it. Yeah, I missed him. Let's go speed priority. Try not to use speed, speed priority all the time. Most of the time I just leave it on my camera and then I end up with like thousands of images at the end of every shoot. So I'm trying to use it a little bit more sparingly now. Be cool if I can get another. Another scooter or something. That would have been cool, but he was way too close. No way. Not unless I'm shooting at like 14 mil. Right. Yeah, I'm going to get on. Have a good one. You Thanks too, man. Take it easy. Oh, it's always nice to bump into people. See, I could stick on the road here and maybe wait for uh, like a scooter or a bike or something to come past, but... I'll head. You know what? I had a feeling. I did. I saw. I saw a bike. Probably from a little way off. I got one. I didn't really move in time though, so yeah. Maybe the first one. A bit of sharpness there, but I didn't keep up with the frame, so. Can you 
much, man. You know what? It's actually quite a cold line, but... Get my EV comp up back up to something a bit more normal. Maybe if we go a little wider. Definitely need more practice in harsh light. Turns out I'm not that good in harsh light, which is a shame. there which is nice See, that was where I shot it at 28, so he was looking really small. Maybe let's try 50, let's try a 50 mil. Because I still want to have a lot of the framing around the edge here. A lot of this framing, but obviously I need more emphasis on someone in, in the actual photo. I think that was cool. 50 mil definitely gives more emphasis on the subject, which is what I wanted. But I think if I had gone right through to 70, I would have lost too much of the actual frame. so harsh. Hello. Okay, bud. Aside from the fact my autofocus missed completely. It must have got one of them, surely. No. Okay. Well, you know what? There might be a few in there that are worth having an edit. Oh, that's actually cool, I didn't even notice that got some really cool light lines like flares coming through which is really nice that might come out quite well in the edit maybe a panning shot 
Some cool frames and some cool silhouettes. And if nothing else, I got out for a lovely walk in the morning. So I think we'll call it quits on that. So that's it for the POV. Hopefully you liked some of the photos. There were some cool ones in there, but there were some obvious throwaways as well. You know what? Every time you pick up a camera, go out at the wrong time of day, different time of day, always going to learn something. And that is literally what it's all about. If you did like the photos, head over to my Instagram. I've linked it in the description below. Come say hello, send me a message. It'll be cool to actually hear from some people who have watched these videos. Who's watching, what you thought, all of those things. Come say hello. I'm well friendly, I promise.